Dozens are feared dead in the Philippines after a fire broke out at a popular mall. It happened in the city of Davao. At least 37 people are feared dead. Recovery efforts are underway. Megan Roberts is tracking the story for us this morning and joins us now. So, Megan, we understand we have some new developments. What are they? That's right, John. So we saw a statement from the mall saying that the fire is finally out. That's after more than 24 hours of flames and smoke that firefighters were battling. So we do understand the fire is now out, though it's still not accessible to anyone other than emergency responders. This is where it's all happening on the isle, on the island of Mindanao in the city of Davao, one of the largest cities in the Philippines at the NCCC Mall. Let's show you some photos of what was happening outside during all of this. You can see people there were trapped on the roof of the mall, straddling the edge there as smoke is billowing out around them, just trying to escape the smoke and the flames. We also have some pictures from inside the mall with what was happening there from a body camera of a firefighter. This is actually close to where the fire started on the third floor. You can still see some flames right there. And this fire spread very quickly up to that top floor where a call center is located. People were trapped and it is understood that there are 37 missing people still, many believed to be employees of that call center. Now, a representative from the mall also said that only the grocery store on the bottom floor and that call center on the top floor were the only businesses open in that mall. So it could have been much, much worse, though there are still 37 people that are missing. And that's really the focus of the investigation right now, according to the mayor of the town of Davao, who is also the uh, daughter of the president of the Philippines. She says right now it's really about finding those 37 missing people, though officials say there's no chance that they could have survived